Basic Math Calculations on Excel 2016. And let's begin with addition. Here we have our chart of monthly expenses that we now want to total. Select the cell where you want the result to appear. Put in an equal sign. Every formula starts with this symbol. Now, using the arrow keys, select the amount to be added and press plus after you select each cell. Then click enter and you have your total. Another way to do this is to select the first amount cell to be added and then press shift as selecting using your arrow keys the rest of the amounts of the amounts you want to add. Then click the sum in the function option in your toolbar and there you have the total. Another third way to do this is to follow the same process, but this time grabbing the right lower corner of your total and just drag it down. And you have the totals automatically. Quite simple. Now let's move to how to do subtraction. Here we have an inventory chart for t-shirts. Select the cell where you want the result. Put an equal sign in this cell. Remember, every formula starts with this symbol. Now starting with the highest number, using the arrow key, select the amount to be added and press minus after you select each cell. And you have the result. To get the results for all of the rows, place your mouse in the lower right corner and drag down. There you have the results for each of the rows. Now let's move on to how to do multiplication. Select the cell where you want the result and put in an equal sign. Then using either your arrow keys or by dragging with your mouse, select the amount you want to be added and press on an asterisk. The asterisk is used for multiplication and you press it after you select each cell. Then press enter and you have your result. To get results in all the rows, Place your pointer at the cell corner, and when you see that cross sign, that copies the formula, so drag it down, and there you have results for each row. Now let's see how to do division. Here we have another report of monthly earnings, and we want to know how to divide it between all the partners. So first, select the cell where you want the result, and put in an equal sign. Using either your arrow keys or dragging with your mouse, Select the highest amount to be divided and then press a forward sign in after you select that amount and then the number of partners to be divided and then press enter and there you have the result. To save time and repeat this and get results in each row, place your pointer in the cell corner and drag down. Now you have results in each row. Now you know how to do basic math calculations using Excel 2016. Hope you enjoyed what you learned. In future videos, we're going to show you how to use formulas when working with large amounts of data.